All right, let's do this. No, the shop sucks. <laughs> At least you gave me that on sale, I guess. I guess. Uh, let me get you. Can I get like a garlic? No. Garlic on sale? No. <laughs> okay, we'll just roll with this. We'll just roll with this. Not the best shop and roll. It'll be good enough. I can beat this guy though. Is it good enough? Is it good enough? Is it good enough? Is it good enough? It is. Poop. That's what you get. You know what, bro? Fuck it. We're going double DPS at the start of the freaking game. In double, double banana. Okay. Double DPS, double banana. Hear me out. I know what you're looking at and I know what you're saying. This guy's weird. It's okay. Cause you're right. You know, you're right. But listen. I'm a freaking win. I'll tell you that much. As soon as I figure out how to organize this, I will freaking win. Which I think I just have to do like this. And then do boom. At least that way, both of the bananas are inside of the store's coffin. So we got the stamina, we got the DPS versus that. And rainbow badge is scary. And we still win. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm not buying both space, but I will buy one. Getting you early is nice, actually. It is nice. Ooh, I like that placement. Hoorah. I like that placement. Okay. All right, I think we win. Right, double DPS versus single DPS. We put on way more blind than he does. Yeah. Okay, three in a row is really, really good, actually. On sale, too? We'll take. Should I get this garlic? No? I'll get it. Oh, buddy, oh, pal. Oh, buddy, oh, pal. We're not in a rush, right? We're not in a rush. I don't want to sell anything. Except the garlic, but I'm not selling these two. So we're not in a rush. I'm gonna roll. I gotta buy that. <laughs> Crap, I didn't want to spend my entire next shop on things I reserved from this shop, but I think I have to. Getting that guy on sale is really good. Keep on healing. Keep on healing! Nope, damn it. First L, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. 13 gold. We, have, we do not have enough space, but that's fine because we're just going to do this. Oh, we do have some space, never mind. Take that back. Crap. Not crap. Perfect. There we go. Nice. Nice. Okay, cool. Now the question is, should I just like stop using double broom after this? Probably not. We have enough stamina generation unless we go get shield, but we're gonna we're about to get a ranged weapon. So we're not gonna be affected by shields from that just one weapon, which is good. Unless it's like a moon shield or something, but it shouldn't be. Not this early, right? Oh, wow. Well, Wow, okay. In that case, I might actually sell you. Cause we're not gonna need you anymore. We get this magic orb. So let's get this magic orb. I didn't really need to sell it. Realistically, I just wanted to, honestly. And then we're gonna get both of those next round. Okay. What was it, round six? This isn't a bad round to have this out. Wait, well, he doesn't have mana generation. It's just a, a baby Excalibur, basically. But we got infinite DPS scaling. We're gonna catch up to his DPS. He just have infinite heat though. Yeah, we're not strong enough, I don't think. Yep, not strong enough. Not yet, per se. Oof. Emphasis on the not yet, huh? Huge emphasis on the not yet. <laughs> Another, what is with you Excaliburs? I'm glad none of you got mana words, but what is with you Excaliburs? And beating me. Stop beating me, okay? I need you to stop. Give me a witch. I like the way this is going. Is that 12? That is 12. Mm -hmm. I like the way this is going. I'm a fan. I'm a fan. 
and we're moving you. Yeah, that's fine. I'm a fan, though. Truly. Yeah, let's just go. I'm a fan. I don't need this banana. You could just give me another blueberry. Wow. So that's what you spend your money on? What did you W key to shop? Certainly you W key the shop to get a Falcon Blade. Two Nikos. You have nothing. My man is straight W keyed Falcon Blades and freaking lamps. My golly. Of course I want that. Of course, I'll take this too. But of course I want that. This is starting to get really nice, really fast. Uh, I guess I'll put you over here. The bananas don't really matter anymore. They're just good for healing, I guess. And I suppose activators too, but mainly good for just healing. Realistically. Poison build, huh? Okay. I don't think I'm too worried. Yeah, I'm not too worried. Uh, you feel me? I'm not too worried. Hey, I'll take it. All right, I need the potion now, though. Yeah, I need the potion now, so we're probably just going to be W keying. We'll buy this. I think we buy this and then we W key for the potion. I think that's the plan. Sell the bananas if we have to. Because that's what we really, really need right now is just that potion. We lose this? I think so. Damn, we're hitting fast. When that heat gets up there, bro, there's no stopping it. We don't need either one of you. We could take this down so I don't get another giraffe. Just give me the potion. I don't need that. All right, no potion. Um, that sucks. But we'll do this. That works. No potion sucks though. I should have probably gotten rid of the deck of cards too, right? What the? Devil magic sacks? What a cauldron? That works. I lied. Ah! <laughs> I lied! Okay. Taking you, taking you. Potion. There's only one potion in the game that I would ever want from you. And you know exactly what it is, but you don't want to give it to me. Because you suck. <laughs> suck balls. Uh, I'm going to turn this like that instead, I think. Okay. Alright, next round we're getting a potion. I'm not stopping until we get this potion. Interesting build. Spike staff, uh, gear with guardian, manifers. Double flu. Interesting build. But we beat you? No, we don't. Alright, we definitely oh, there we go. Thank you. Got the potion. And we can put you right there. And now we need more cards. Another giraffe. Uh, prismatic orb. Yeah, we need that. We can move you over by one. Hold this down. Do that. The food doesn't matter to me. Okay, maybe the banana does. Actually, I'll keep both of the bananas. Yeah, I'll keep both bananas. Um, but we don't really have to use both bananas until our build is a little bit better. We're good on mana generation too, so we'll just do this. Like, that'll work. That'll work. This build should be solidified now though. Especially if we win them against this guy. Especially. Yeah, our mana generation is perfect. And then the blueberries just go crazy with the clover generation generates even more heat with a 64 at the end. Nuts. Now we're unhealing. I'll take that. Should I take this? I'll take this. Oh my god, double in a row is nuts. Uh, should I take it though? Because we're doing fine without the other giraffe, like... 
I'll take it. Just because we're doing fine without the other giraffe. I feel like we'll be I feel like we'll be okay. What the frick? Three claws of attack with the thorn bloom? I'm like barely eating well he's at three stamina potions, but still. Man is a maniac. Yeah, we definitely need that other giraffe. Look how much clovers we're generating. We beat this guy landslide. Landslide beat that guy. But look how much clovers we're generating, bro. So many blueberries. It's fucking dank. Like I'll keep buying things even though I'm like telling myself I need other things. I'm like, no. I will keep buying these things because they're just here. That's the only reason I'm buying them. It's because they're here and I see them. Only reason. We did really good on the cards though that round. That'll just help us out with our survivability so we can survive burst builds. So only reason I did that. Because of the white dragons give me so much block. And then we just get a shit ton of mana from the uh, the lotus and cleansing the debuffs. And now all this stuff is just stacking up that heat and healing for every little bit of health that I can punch out of anything. I don't even need more blueberries. I don't even know why I bought that. Gain six random buffs, resist one critical hit. Nah, I'm good. I am good. I'm honestly just looking for like one more giraffe. If you could like give me that, that would be great. Alrighty. <laughs> it's like, no, I refuse. I only need one more game, please. I like a prismatic orb. Give me one more in a prismatic orb and I'd be fine. The greatest part about this build is the fact that we don't need stamina. Well, we do need stamina, but like we don't hit. That's the greatest part. Like we don't have to worry about shields. We don't have to worry about spikes. You know what I mean? Like that's the greatest part. It's stress free. We have a stress fee build. Thank you for that. All right, now the only thing uh, that I would ever want and need now would just be a nice prismatic orb. And that's it. So next round, we're W King for a prismatic orb and we're not gonna stop until we get one. Whoa, what is this, a fatigue build? This is a fatigue build, interesting. I've never seen one before. I thought these went extinct. He's removing my buffs like crazy though. So that's, uh, that's concerning. My heat, bro, no. My heat. Okay, we still win. Even without the heat generation, we still win. But heat, one, two, three, four, five of those, man. Five of just removing your buffs, five of them. He's removing your buffs. He's stun locking you with two shields. And on top of that, he's got 80% faster there. He's got triple freaking corrupted crystals. This guy is insane. I'm surprised we won even without the heat. Wow. Okay, so we're, we're, we don't need you. We don't need you. We just need one prismatic orb. I got 12 gold to give you. I got 12 gold to give you for a prismatic orb. Right. It's so tempting. We generate enough mana. I don't need you. Okay. All right, what are we selling? <laughs> what do we need, seven? I can sell both of the bananas. That'll be four, and then I can sell that for eight. Because there's nothing else I want to sell except blueberries, right? That's about it. We gotta, we have to make the sacrifices. Okay. All right, righty. I'm happy I got that. I'm so happy I got that. So let's see if we can like kind of minimize our situation here a little bit by doing this. Just moving the entire board over by like two over here. All right, that looks good. Then we could do this, that can go up there. And then all this extra space over here can just be like the blueberries, I guess. 
We can even start the deck of cards over here if we really wanted to. But this area is going to be for the Prismatic Orb right over here. So this area is Prismatic Orb. Which, honestly, I might have to, like, do something different over here, maybe. Maybe. Uh, We'll see, because a deck of cards needs to work. That not working is not an option. Oops. Huh. That might do it. Yeah, this might do it. So we can go boom. And then fire. I guess we could just, well, no, because this needs to go up there. Yeah, so that's not gonna work actually. Huh. Um. Well, how much space do we realistically need? Cause that needs to just do that. Like this is fine. There we go. That's better. Yeah, that's good. Okay, so the rest of the space will just be used for the deck of cards. Which, this should be plenty enough space for a deck of cards. Yeah, this is plenty of space for a deck of cards, right? Or am I coping? Am I coping? I'm not coping. Boom. 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 Beautiful. Okay, we made it. This is... This is the build, guys. Okay, this is the build. Um, the only thing that can make this better is using jewels, obviously, inside of armor slots for the amplified healing. Or even the blue jewels for the armor generation because of all the mana that you're gaining. But that's the only way to make this better. But basically, it's just a build that utilizes heat to heal a sh a super fast while also dealing damage, right? So we're gaining heat from the Hail Fire Wizards, which is infinitely generated because of the Misfortunes, which uses the Clovers that are generated from both of the Toads. And once we reach that 10 mana threshold, all of the Blueberries start generating enough Clovers as well. Um, and I got the Prismatic Orb because we have that 20% increase in healing because of the four Shiny Shells. Um, and that's really the only reason I even had these in the first place. But yeah, the 20% increase in healing means 20% increase in damage too right and survivability right so that's always always a good thing um and then we got these two here just for the early game in the middle of the game survivability just in case we go get some burst build or anything like that having that extra armor really does help a lot until we can get the build up and rolling because at the beginning it's not super crazy but once it gets to like the ender part it's really really good which we're going against a burst build so let's see how we do here you see he's doing like so much damage to us at the beginning Oh my god, as soon as I throw <laughs> that, I, that just makes me so mad. That pissed me off. I don't care. That made me mad. Fuck burst builds. Fuck burst builds. If you run burst builds, fuck you. If you run freaking longsword, hammer, dagger, fuck. If you run this, kick <laughs> you. Because I was having fun. And then I run into this, bro. Like, oh my gosh, bro. See, this is what I get for selling my cap, okay? Make sure you guys roll with at least 10 caps of discomforts whenever you're playing this game because you're gonna get five of these builds every time you play, okay? Minimum, okay? Different variations, hammers, daggers, bows, arrows, whatever. Just f 10, 15, even 20 with yellow gems in them, okay? Just warning. Okay, because this build easily beats this guy if it just survives for a little bit longer. Man, that just made me so freaking upset. You didn't even give me a chance. Fuck this guy. All right, I'm done. You guys have a good one.